Can Maguire's ultimate compound get rid of this scratch? Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are seeing if Maguire's compound can uh, cover up this scratch here. So this is on the front left of the um, of the car, the front front left of the bumper. And look how deep that scratch is. That is really really deep. So um, basically, I think. I'd imagine one of these scratches would have occurred by going over a speed bump too quickly or um, potentially grazing it, um, grazing it on a, uh, on a gutter or something. I'm not too sure how this one occurred. However, there is a scratch there. So basically what I'm doing is uh, getting the compound all, all up over the scratch um, and seeing how much it can get rid of. I mean, really and truly to get rid of this scratch, uh, you probably need a new bumper. Um, or a respray or something. Um, but let's just see how much we can hide uh, this scratch. Um, again, not expecting to get rid of all of it, just some of it and, and hide it as much as possible. So I've done the first pass, which uh, was a really soft pass. I didn't wanna go too hard too early. Um, just a really soft pass. You could see I wasn't really putting much pressure on the, um, on the polisher. So I'm going, just going to do a second pass here and see see how it goes. So just wiping off all, all the excess compound, obviously. Um, I mean, <laughs> I did wash the car to get rid of the contaminants because I don't want to be uh, um, rubbing the contaminants into into the into the uh, the scratch. So uh, you can see in the reflection there all the soap on the on the ground. Uh, that's not that's not the scratch. That is just soap on the ground. So uh, apologies for. Um, for for that so let's go with the second pass now this one i'm going to go a little bit firmer not too firm obviously but as you can see i've got my second hand on the uh on the weight of the uh of the polisher and we're just gonna go over that do another pass and see how it comes out again not really expecting to get rid of this scratch completely i just want to see if I can dilute it a little bit because um, it, it's, it's on the bottom of the bumper you can barely you can barely see it if you're uh, um, if you're looking at the car but it's definitely there definitely there so um, yeah so that's the second pass and that actually looks pretty pretty damn good to be honest I mean you can see how deep those scratches are I don't know what it would it hit unfortunately but um, you can really, really see how deep those, that, those scratches are. And there's no way you could really get that out by compounding. Um, again, as I said, you probably need a new bumper or a respray or something um, to get that out. So this, that's what it looked like before. So as you can see, um, very white, um, the scratches. Um, and that's what it looked like after. So heavily, heavily diluted, which is, uh, which is really good. Um, I mean, to be honest with you, it's done a lot better than what I thought it would. I didn't think it would do much because the scratches are so deep, but it's definitely diluted the scratches. So I'm just trying to focus the camera here. So on the edges there, you can kind of see a little bit of the scratches there. But again, you've got to be so close to see it. Like you can't, you can't even see it <laughs> much when I draw the camera away. Um, so yeah, I mean, look, definitely a step if you've got these deep scratches to do and just see how good you can get it. Um, but thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe or watch another one of my videos.